you know, knowing that we're moving towards an ecological catastrophe and that we have to be ready to, you know, regiment the population and control them in a, in a more extreme way than we've ever done before. Well, you bring up something that with, um, that the sort of like the mythic undercurrent of why people tend to stay away from the vaccines or why that like whole, I'm going to call it subculture, right? Of a sort of, uh, I don't want to call it, I mean, it concludes things like neo shamanism and, and, you know, health, it, new, um, what's the word, like natural health practitioners, right? All that stuff. That there is a substructure there, which is a sort of, um, fear of of you know we've touched on it too on this series as well like this technocratic agenda right and you also you use this um distinction that i can't remember the author's name who, who who offered it but it's uh this difference between soft strategy and hard conspiracy mm -hmm. uh and actually i like that actually because it helped me differentiate too right between uh the nuances there that i wait and i'd just love for you to actually speak that of what you understand those two to mean now Oh yeah, absolutely. So that was referring to, I mean, I always love to give credit where credit is due to this guy, Darren Allen, who's an anarcho-primitivist um, in England, uh, who has been writing some interesting stuff around, around his views. But yeah, I mean, um, and you know, he's a total, you know, anti-vax. Um, but you know, the, the question of whether this was like, you know, hard conspiracy, if there was like a, a nuclei of like intelligence operatives, you know, who were like, okay, you know, China and, you know, Europe and America kind of working together that like, we're going to, test drive, unleashing, you know, moderately, you know, deadly pandemic on the world that will allow us to actually, you know, do all the things that we want to do, which is like, you know, lock down, force more biometric IDs, um, uh, suspend civil rights, you know, make protests impossible, you know, knowing that we're moving towards an ecological catastrophe and that we have to be ready to, you know, regiment the population and control them in a, in a more extreme way than we've ever done before. Uh, this will be, this will be an opportunity to do that. So that's the hard conspiracy idea, which, I mean, I'm, I'm still not averse to that, you know, being the case that I, I, I you know, I think that there's reasons to think that uh, if you trace some of these lines that, um, that that's all quite possible. Uh, soft strategy is more, it's just, you know, Darren writes a lot about, he wrote a book called 33 Myths of the System, that it's just the logic of the whole system that we're in, that it's, you know, basically, uh, you know, egoic, uh, materialistic, control oriented, and has, you know, sought over centuries and centuries to, you know, appropriate more control, more technologies of control. And um, this is just a logical, you know, continuation, uh, in, you know, of that. Mm -hmm. 